My name is Beverly and I love to draw cats. I'm a professional artist and working from photographs, I've drawn cats from all over the world. I create portraits in colored pencil and then share the story of each cat and the art process here on video. <laughs> Today I'm drawing Tippy, a beautiful senior who had a rough start in life but became the ideal first time cat for her rescuer, Lena. Lena was a busy graduate student in North Texas and wasn't looking to be a cat person when a sickly Tippy showed up at her door in 2007. The woman next door supposedly took care of the cat and her sibling, but it was clear that Tippy was very underweight and in need of treatment for a bad respiratory infection. Not knowing what else to do, Lena gave the hungry cat some lunch meat. The next day, Tippy came back for more and wanted to be petted too. Soon the visits turned into a daily thing. Lena wanted to do something more but wasn't prepared to take in a pet. For one thing, her roommate didn't like cats. Lena also didn't have a job and wasn't in a good position to take on the responsibility. So she looked for a rescue group that might take Tippy. But no one was willing to accept a sickly adult cat, especially during kitten season when adoption cages were filled to maximum capacity. Left with no other options, Lena finagled a deal with her roommate to allow her to keep Tippy in the apartment for a month while Lena searched for another place to move. In the meantime, she got the thin little cat to the veterinarian where they spayed her and sent home medication for her respiratory problem. After four or five months, she shook off the infection and had doubled her weight. Since then, Tippy has accompanied Lena through many life changes, finishing graduate school, starting a new job, and moving to different apartments. Tippy has taken it all in stride and has been very easy as a first time cat. Unlike many cats, she's no trouble at all to bathe, to clip nails, or to medicate. She's an affectionate lap cat with Lena, but warms up to strangers very slowly preferring people who have a quiet and gentle energy about them. She loves to cuddle with Lena's mom when she comes down from Oklahoma, and when Lena goes back home to visit, she brings the cat with her, although Tippy's not a fan of the long car ride. On a typical day, Tippy enjoys listening to classical music that Lena leaves on while she's away at work. In typical cat fashion, she mostly sleeps during the day, but also enjoys nibbling on the houseplants and drinking from her fountain. When her human gets home, Tippy greets her at the door and expects to be brushed. She did not enjoy the times Lena experimented with taking her out on a leash, but seems to be getting used to going out in a stroller. Tippy watches intently when Lena makes dinner for herself and will get right in her face if she has something yummy like salmon or chicken. Lena doesn't leave Tippy out though. Sometimes she buys her rotisserie chicken or turkey lunch meat, which might be Tippy's favorite. This cat has learned to ask for what she wants in life and seems to know that looking pretty while you're doing it doesn't hurt. Tippy's come a long way since she showed up begging for love and food at Lena's door. Because of that chance encounter, Lena made the decision to take on more responsibility and to put someone else's needs ahead of her own. In return, she has been rewarded with Tippy's loving and constant presence for the past 12 years and counting. Here's the finished portrait. To see more of these cat videos, or to find out how to commission a portrait for your cat, visit my website, ilovetodrawcats.com.